A crime alert right now. Mobile police say a man in the Midtown area was the victim of a theft after he let a person who appeared to be a water service employee inside his house. Yeah, our Steve Alexander standing by live now to tell us how it happened and what you need to know to stay safe. Steve? Well, fortunately, the man wasn't hurt and police as well as officials with Moz, the Mobile Area Water and Sewer System, offer important advice. Mobile police say it happened on Tuesday night on Jasmine Street. They got a call about a man posing as a utility worker for Moss. They say he went to the victim's house and told him he was there to check the water pressure, and the victim let him in. Police say the victim noticed he had several items missing from his house once the man left. How do you feel about somebody doing this to you, brother? Well, it's just, uh, it's upsetting, it's disturbing. Tony Palugi is the victim's nephew. How is he doing? Is he traumatized by it? No, he wasn't manhandled or anything. The guy just came in and snatched some snuff, snatched some banking billing statements, and of course, we got his accounts transferred over from his bank, and then they snatched some singles and some $2 bills, and he snatched some expired medication. So that's, that. it was in there probably less than two or three minutes. Other people who live in the area were upset to hear about the crime. It's bad. Christmas time, people doing stuff like this is bad. Moz officials say their workers rarely come inside to do work and all should have a valid ID. So before you open the door, call Moz to confirm. And the victim's nephew says there could have been other victims too. He says he knows of two other residents where one neighbor didn't let the man in and another ran him off the property. Reporting live for the newsroom, Steve Alexander, Fox 10 News.